This is how it starts. This is, this, uh, is type. And each of these is a letter or a symbol, the number, etc. This is, uh, comes in a variety of, and this is actually the first decorated face, Union Pearl, mm -hmm. up this back in the 16th century. It's a very old face. You put it like this, just loop your words. I'm not doing anything special here. If you give me these, Okay. That's the way you do it. That's a type stick and everything. This is what you get. And this is known as a chase. This middle thing holds the type. These are, this is known as furniture, furniture. Then you take, these are coins, these things here, mm -hmm. and you tighten them. Here's what they look like. They come in various sizes and kinds, but they look sort of like that. Mm -hmm. And this thing is a key, and they just, it just, it's, it by tightening on them, they, they become, they expand. It to make sure all tape is down and then tighten it for final there. This is the ink. It's a little thick. That's because it's so cool. Now that is, this is known as a clamshell press, and it was, they're all, this is a peerless, it was made in about 1896, this date from, so it's fairly old, it's an old design. Why it's colder than this is for obviously it's individual letters and you press them <laughs> against paper to copy that. These are all printed that way. But, and you sit right in there. That's all I saw. Now, these are against called uh, guides, and they come various kinds, but you put them in to guide the paper. This holds it there, and then you get one over here on the side. That's 18, and that is 18. Perfect. <laughs> what you do with that? Turn it on. Let it ride. This is hand painting, obviously. Uh, there are presses, maybe there are presses that are with automatic feet on them. I used to have one years ago. That's, that's this kind of printing. That's how you do it. And 
you, if you don't show too much of that, people will think you're printing all at once. <laughs> <laughs> but they're actually, well, there'll be there are three different runs on this.